Uh, so, uh, take two of my, I don't know, first vlog, uh, watching Spider-Man, just, just to chill, I think it's just like, I think they call it 2.1, which is pretty good, but name's Gavin, I'm gonna have a channel for vlogging every day of my life, you know, just having some memories that are gonna be good, uh, I don't know what it's gonna be called, but I'll just put it up on there, and then, you know, do a, do a little bit of what I do, you know, just editing, editing some of it, and, it's something I really haven't done before, but I'm willing to get into it. It seems a lot of people are doing it. I mean, ooh, what's going to happen? Somebody's going to look at me weird because i got a phone in my face talking into it. Ooh. I don't care. Uh, I don't know. I'm really just doing this to have have fun, you know? Why not? 15 is going to live my life and do a little bit of vlogging. Uh, something about me in 15 from Tennessee. Um... Uh, I love JDM cars, which is like Hondas and all this import crap. Anything on the Japanese market, man. Just, this is the kind of cars I like. Uh, I'm in a car club. I own a car club, really. It's uh, called Low and Slow Nation. L O W and S L O W Space Nation. Check us out on Facebook. We're up to about 14 to 15 members. Uh, really just swagging out. <laughs> like, no lie. Um, from Irwin, Tennessee, you can tell with the accent, so it kind of sucks, but, eh, you know, but I mean, it's about 12, 13 at night, just uh, looking on the computer at some car parts that I'm thinking about picking up, I don't have a car yet, I'm just gonna, you know, get some parts that I like, like a tow hook or something, because I mean, I am gonna buy a Honda, and then I'm gonna get, um, but when I do get my car, my friends, like, Come to my house to have like JDM cars, man. I'll, I'll take a video for you guys and let you guys see them. They're pretty sweet, but like uh, just to say a name here, Miguel Diaz. He's got a pretty nice Honda. It's been it's like lowered, you know. And then his brother ran into a pothole and he scratched it up, and like the exhaust came off. It was terrible, man. So he's got that at out at Jim's Motorcycles, which here in Irwin, it's like a place to get your car fixed. So he's they're getting a new exhaust on it. Hopefully we'll have it ready for the car show Friday. I hope. I mean, if not, I don't think we'll go to it. But car club's gonna be doing a car wash here pretty soon, just to get some money, man. I gotta get, a, I gotta get a paper flow somehow. I gotta get a cheddar. Cause I mean, a couple of us have jobs, but I mean, fifteen, fourteen, and fifteen. You know, a couple, of, a couple of us are like twenty, twenty-one. I'm fifteen, so you know it's hard for me to find a job. And <laughs> so that sucks, but. I'll get one here pretty soon. Get everything I want on my car. Um, Fourth of July is tomorrow. What are y'all doing, man? You know me. I'm just gonna go to the cousin's house, Summer Hughes, hang out with her. Uh, hang out with her boyfriend Nick. It's my boy. Ch chill out. Uh, a couple of the fam is gonna be there. Just gonna grill out. You know, watch the fireworks out there. And, Bernardo might be there. My boy. I'm talking to her right now about this vlogging thing. You know, we'll take some videos together and. See what's up with all of it. Um, but, I don't know. Something to talk about. First vlogs, so, you know, I don't really have topics laid out like I should. But, uh, oh, my, my Myrtle Beach trip. That's what I wanted to talk about. So I went to Myrtle Beach. I went, I stayed for a week. I went, uh, a week from this Saturday, like, Saturday? Like, last Saturday? I went a week before that on that Saturday and stayed a week. Myrtle Beach is a fun time. A lot of characters out there. Some good, some bad. You know, what are you gonna do? People all like that in the world. Uh, a lot of people. Like, you'll be in the midst of summer. And the way this weather is, dude, the beach was just like everybody's hot spot. A lot of people went down there. Sorry, just had to chill back my chair. Uh, we were down there. Me, my cousin, her boyfriend, and her family just out there, you know, just having a little bit of fun, staying a week. Uh, I'll tell you about our first day there. We got lost, and we got backtracked, so we got there about 4 o'clock, so. First thing we did, we took us a nap, man. It's a, we took a 6-hour drive into an 8-hour drive, you know. It sucked. I didn't have to drive. Her, her boyfriend did. And just being cooped up in that car for so long, man, to get out and walk around was amazing. So we took us about an... 30 minute power nap, 30 minute to an hour power nap, you know, woke up, went on the beach, man, you talk about being out in that water, dude, that was amazing, 
like I know people have swam in pools before, but I mean just being out in the like like the ocean, it just looks like it drops off. I know I know it was my first time going, so that's why I have a lot to talk about. And just to go out there was just sick, man. I didn't swim like a far out because there's been a lot of shark attacks down there and there's a lot of shark spawns. So that's not something I wanted to do. I ain't getting eaten up by a shark, but <laughs> I don't know. Nick did. He loved it. He got it to his neck. I'm I'm five eleven, got out to my knees, so I don't know. I had fun. Uh yeah, twenty percent battery swag. <laughs> nah, but just uh, our second night, didn't really do anything special. Went and got some to eat, walked up and down the strip, and then Nothing too big, and then Wednesday we went to what was called Broadway at the beach, dude, and that was fun. It was uh, just a big place like Ron John's Surf Shop. There's a lot of places out there. There was a candy store, and it was funny, dude. They had, like, candy G-strings and shit. It wasn't like a sex shop. It was just like a candy store for kids. I thought that was pretty funny, and uh, all around it was, it was a good trip. Sucked to leave. I didn't want to leave, man. It's pretty terrible, but... Gotta do some things you don't like in your life. I mean, if it wouldn't be for me saving up for a car and putting stuff on it that I want, I would not have left. Like, me and Nick were gonna go back down. He had the money, you know. I didn't have the money. He was like, all right, well, you know, we'll just stay. And it pretty sucked. Pretty much sucked. But, I don't know, it's good to be back in her 